Although internet users should doubt the public waves, one thing we should never fear and in fact embrace is networking. That's why we sat down with a business coach who's doing his part to break down networking barriers. Here's a look. Michael Fletcher is CEO of New World Coaching, a company that is best known for providing encouragement and education combined with the necessary tools to help clients improve their business and personal lives. However, unlike most business coaches, Michael has experienced his fair share of ups and downs, which makes his teachings especially effective. We could uh, actually give business owners um, different tools, uh, ways to avoid the pitfalls that I had to go through because I've been bankrupt and I've been to the top and everywhere in between. And it was just such a wonderful opportunity to be able to see the spark when you help people and the ideas sink in and they go, I get it and they can move forward. In just two years, Michael's innovative company has grown to include something called the Beehive Game, an interactive activity that truly breaks down barriers. The Beehive Game is one of the ways we uh, break down some of the walls for networking. Well, knowing your business is 20%, what we work on is the other 80%. You know, we teach you how to, and we work with you, to leverage your network. Um, be able to have better time management. Now, breaking down nervous barriers is imperative in business. However, how can something like a beehive game assist the common executive? It's a loud, high energy event. Um, most people have a fear when they go to network and they walk in, they're afraid to meet anybody, so they go find people they're comfortable with. And then it becomes a social function and no real networking, no business is created from it. So what we do at the Beehive Game is we break everybody into small groups of hives. Everybody gets to be a queen bee. Everybody gets to be a worker bee. So the object is, is everybody writes down what they're looking for because we're always looking for something. It's loud, it's energetic, and it's high intensity. So how does this possibly translate into effective networking? And since we all know 200 people, or more, um, if you can help, you give a business card. However, according to Michael, there's much more to learn from the Beehive game than just networking. This, this game teaches you so much about you as a queen, as a leader, is your message clear and concise? Are you getting what you expect for results? As a worker, did I try my hardest? Or did I just kind of drag my feet and go through the motions? As the hive, did you give out as many leads as you possibly could? Or were you holding back, afraid to actually go, yeah, here's somebody. And how you play this game is how you play your life.